Hey, this is Robert with Clean Pool and Spa. In, in this video, I'm going to talk a little bit about sodium dichlor, uh, dichlor chlorine, and hopefully that's not too blurry. You can see that right there. Uh, and basically, there are two kinds of chlorine that you need to concern yourself with two categories. Uh, one is stabilized and unstabilized. Uh, the difference is this. The sodium dichlor already has stabilizer in there. Stabilizer, cyanuric acid, conditioner, um, they're basically all the same thing. Compared to liquid chlorine, this is um, liquid chlorine sodium hypochlorite, this is not stabilized. So um, a couple applications you can use with sodium dichlor uh, is you can use that for a new fill if you need to get cyanuric acid or stabilizer in there quickly. And it's one pound of um, dichlor will increase uh, the chlorine level 10 parts per million and it will also increase the stabilizer nine parts per million. So uh, for a new pool, uh, you can shock that a couple times and get some stabilizer in there very quickly. Also, it's pretty good to uh, try to contain black algae. Um, might say, for instance, if you have black algae on the steps or on the floor, you can simply open up, simply open up the dichlor and um, sprinkle that right on the steps or on the floor. Let that sit and uh, try to contain that black algae. Uh, once you hit the 30 parts per million mark with the stabilizer, you wanna go and switch to liquid chlorine. You do not wanna use dichlor for your weekly pool maintenance, uh, pool chlorination, uh, weekly shocking, because it's going to increase the cyanuric acid very quickly, and it's gonna get out of hand, and you're gonna probably have to do a partial drain and refill. Uh, so only use dichlor when you need to, and again, when you hit the 30 parts per million mark, uh, cyanuric acid, go and switch to liquid chlorine. And that is it, so check out the, the description box below, link to my website, cleanpoolandspa.com. Lots of great information over there, like, subscribe, and comment. As always, be safe, and happy swimming. Bye.